Hi everyone, welcome to today's episode of the presidential elections. Today we talk about the election of 1964. So this election took place on November 3rd of 1964. We have two candidates. The first is the current incumbent president, Lyndon B. Johnson of Texas, who took over the presidency right after JFK was assassinated by Lee Harvey Oswald. He was a Democrat. He had 486 electoral votes. The popular vote, he got 43,127,041. And his running mate was Hubert Humphrey. The second candidate was Barry Goldwater of Arizona. He was a Republican. He had 52 electoral votes. He got 27,175,754 of the popular vote. And his running mate is William Miller. Uh, okay, so if, uh, how many electoral votes that were needed and how many were there in total? Pretty much from this election all the way up to the present day, and at least until when we get a new state. This is when we have our two favorite numbers of the Electoral College, 270 needed and 538 in total. This is kind of where it, you know, kind of began. Overall turnout of this election was 61.9%, in which it went down 0.9%. Yeah. Alright, thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you all tomorrow when we talk about the election of 1968. Stay cool, stay tuned. Sorry for it being so dark. Thanks so much for watching. If you would like to subscribe to my channel, click on the circle to your right. If you would like to see the last series on this channel, click the square on your left. The last series done on this channel was The Census. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks so much for watching. Have a fantastic day.